Inviscate. I N V I S C A T E. Inviscate. That is correct. In the last decade, it's become pretty obvious, I think, that South Asian Americans are dominating the national spelling bee. Gazelle Shad. Congratulations! I'm just speechless. I can't say anything. I mean, I'm only in fifth grade. <laughs> Indian Americans make up less than 1% of the national population. They make up about 20% of the 280 plus contestants at the Scripps B. Something clearly is going on that needs to be better understood. Your word is tiki. There are these actually Indian only or South Asian only spelling bees that take place across the country. We have access to so many more words. We've seen the spotlight. So yeah, I think we do have some advantage going in. Welcome to the Vukoti spelling bee. Vukoti regional, regional spelling bee. Okay. The South Asian American community, in particular the Indian American community, is a somewhat hidden but fundamental role in why these kids do well in the bee. Family has a large role to play. That's what we believe in, in academic pursuit. Androcentric. A-N-D-R-O-C-E-N-T-R-I-C. Androcentric. I know that I can't memorize all 476,000 words in there. So I just decided that, oh, maybe looking for patterns in words will work. I was preparing for four to five hours a day, and on weekends, like eight hours a day, 10 hours a day. Luck is for losers. Winners work hard. Congrats, you guys. What do you want to do now that the spelling bee is over? I just want to go home and start playing video games. It's a game. You are in the game to win it, but even if you don't win it, you learn a lot. That helps you tremendously in your life.